so we're at Bunker. I'm joined by Rio. Nice and romantic date with Rio. Now Rio is performing tonight, and um, he's actually he's had a bit of time to chill out. Yeah, and have a drink. So Rio, literally, just tell me about yourself. I want to know. I want to know everything. Basically, about MC slash artist from Manchester. Um, signed to a manager's label, where I bring music, independent label. Um, and yeah, do music for a living. Okay, um, so you were playing at Bunker earlier. Yeah. yeah. And, um, and how did you set go? Like, what sort of thing were you playing? Is it you writing a lot at the moment, a lot of new material, or is it stuff that you've kind of had around for a while and you're kind of playing it out? Yeah, I performed, sorry, my first single, which is called Now Roads. That was. Narrow Yeah, that was released last year, January, that was kind of like the opening track. It's kind of got the ball rolling, it's done really well, but it's separate. Uh, got a lot of support from one extra and stuff like that, so that was really good. Cool. Fantastic. And then I went into a bit of a hip hop track, you know, just showing okay. a bit of versatility, you know, as an artist, which is really epic because the crowd response was really, really good. Every time I come to the people, they always make me feel warm and welcome, so I really appreciate them. Yeah. Yeah. Is that because there is a little bit of Manchester Liverpool vibe? Yeah, there, yeah, yeah, but. I thought, I thought, when I said, I'm from Manchester, Manchester. <laughs> get off. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. No, but it was great, it was great. Um, and then the last song we did was my um, latest single called okay. What If. Uh, Is that also like one of your newest? Yeah, that, that, that's a bit different. It's a bit um, good stuff in pop. Okay. I've got like a KDB vibe. Like okay. Girls singing on the hook called Abigail. And the guys who made produce the track, which is um, good times for OB. So you, you integrate quite a few genres then into your yeah. sort of music. You keep it quite a is, is that how you sort of want to see yourself like progressing as well? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I came up from grime, so obviously I love doing grime, but okay. I wouldn't like, <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't like pigeonhole myself into one genre. No. You know, I've got the freedom of the ability to, to do anything. I've thrown at me really. You know, music is a universal language, so I don't mind, you know, doing a dubstep track or an electro, you know, or working with live band and stuff like that. I enjoy doing that as well. So, the, you know, my latest single, what if, kind of shows the versatility as an artist okay. as well as a musician and, and it done really well it's got a lot of support by the DJs and obviously the target obviously yeah. was Mr Jam I think he premiered it for us and we've got some hot remixes as well okay so where like basically what have you got coming up over the summer the most important thing is that we know where you're going to be where if you've got sort of anything lined up are you doing any festivals um, yeah um, at the moment I'm on a school tour school tours are always great because they just treat you like it's a fair base, though, they just they, when you go into schools, honestly, they make you feel like you're like some major yeah, celebrity. Joking. Scream! You know, I was gonna say that. It's a bit like, okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna speak to Rich. Rich is on tour in October. Yeah. And you know, we get on Rich is a very nice guy. So I'm gonna you know speak to my left and right. We get on that tour. Yeah. Uh, so Liverpool Sand City as well. Right? A lot of feedback I'm getting it's really a lot about networking isn't it yeah. and kind of just meeting people and just chatting. Yeah I mean that's how we got to meet as well just by talking. It's like oh, that's amazing heaven. Yeah I think networking's helped me progress a lot being a manager like, yeah. it's such a great thing to just to get to places and network. Uh, you know, you're gonna meet me after my performance I've got an uh, email that's crazy so it's up and he's like, right. like booking agent and he's like amazing so it's yeah. great. Get down to this game and all that like, So it's good that you know, I've got such a good performance, but networking is definitely, I never know who's watching or who knows who. Good work, my man, good work. So, um, website, any, any details for us that you can yes. tell us, check you out, or any downloads that we can get? Yeah, um, I released the mixtape called Push the Start with a DJ. Okay. The stylist, it's a bit different. They're creative. It's, when you download it, you understand. And, in the first week I had like 8,000 downloads. So for, for unsigned artists, I think that was really overwhelming to, to know I had that kind of support. Um, you can get that from www.officialrio.co.uk. Make sure you download it, it's free. Appreciate the music, it's really good, it's really different, really creative. Um, it's a good one. Yeah. And I've got something that I'm working on. Um, it's just an idea, me and DJ Center Smoke about an idea, I've actually started it yet, but I'm going to start it soon. And I'm working on an EP that I'm going to sell because I think it's time now. i uh, put out music because I've got a lot of free music for you guys. I think it's time now that, you know, I sell the materials. Yeah, stop making money out of it. It's right, it's only right. So I'm going to work on a 10 track EP. I'm going to sell that. It should be out in August, or Hear Me Now. And for more information... Hear Me Now! 
Hey, me now. <laughs> For more information, go to my Twitter at Rio Music 10, all one word, number 10, 10, Rio Music 10. Fan page on Facebook, it's r.i.o. Um, hit them on there. And yeah, you're just going to see a lot of collaborations with artists, you know, in London. And, and artists that do different genres, like speaking to Ed. I love Ed Sheeran's work, you know, I think it's quality. Oh. And, and I'm not, oh, I know, I like stepping out of the box, I'm not scared to try things. You know. Yeah. Yeah, I like trying things. That's what it's all about, man. Well, thank you so much, Rio. That's fantastic. It was a pleasure, thank you. Yes, we'll be seeing more of you. <laughs>